I also yeah. like um, I was kind of similar where like um, whenever I I was always afraid to freestyle and people would do it at like parties um, and I would always like avoid those situations. Like for me, I was always like, I don't want to say I never wanted to repeat a rap lyric. And, or I don't know, I kind of just made up these excuses of like, I didn't want this to happen. I didn't want this to happen. So I just would just avoid it altogether. Um, but then once I just got more comfortable um, doing it, um, I kind of broke it down to like, just like learning some rhymes and then building sentences around those rhymes. Um, and also like it kind of freestyling, it can also be kind of like a meditative experience. And it's like, um, rather than like being in your head and like thinking about what you want to say, if you can just like feel it in your body and then just like say the words that like your body is feeling, um, get into it and, and just commit to saying right. what you feel. Commit. Yeah. You commit to the commit. feeling of it. Yeah. Yeah. Committing to the, the message and like what you want to say and, and jumping in. And I think going back to your question, David, of like what makes it good, right. Is like, sometimes you have to just like jump. And you have to like j have the ability to jump and know that like you're gonna either fall into something good or fall fall into something bad. But either way, like you need that that movement. You need to like keep moving in order to to have something either to fall fall well or you know. But yeah, yeah, I think it's just being able to take that jump and that leap is like and getting into situations like keep putting yourself into situations where you have to do that. Um, I think yeah. that's, that's what I'm trying to do, whether this is that situation or, or another collaboration or on stage or, or the cypher or whatever. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Some, something else I've realized too, is that like everybody that's listening to somebody freestyle is only ever listening to like the bar that they're saying right now. So if you just jump in and you start saying something shitty, you can always just like <laughs> try to say something better. And then people are always just like paying attention to what you're currently saying, which is kind of a nice feeling. Um, the, like, which kind of people's natural instinct is to like make a mistake and then talk about that mistake. But then when you've done that, then you've actually just devoted like two or three bars to like the same mistake. Whereas if you just like move on to the next thing, like people will just be paying attention to what you're like doing right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like reading, yeah, you're, it's like reading a book or something. You read like a messed up ass sentence and then you just keep reading the book and you're like, oh, okay. Well, that sentence didn't make much sense, but <laughs> moving forward, yeah, didn't even this need makes, it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 